Congratulations Thank on winning you. the game. Finally, I've been a huge fan of yours, and I have to say, my nine-year-old niece just started watching Survivor. She is thrilled that you won tonight. Thank so you. So congratulations. Thank you very much. What's it like having the fans? I mean, you kind of went from the villainous role to a hero. Tonight, the house was all in favor of you. What's that feel like? It's awesome, man. You know, it's the fans that have kept this show on the air as long as it has been. And it's the fans that dictate, you know, what contestants they bring back season after season. Fortunately, I was able to come back and get four shots at this thing and finally get a W. So, thank you to all the fans. Now, what's it like going into this game, playing with buffoons? People who have obviously never seen the game before. Are you happy about that? You know what, look at here's the thing. Like I said to Jeff in the live show tonight, there was a lot of hard work that went into getting to me to where I was in this game. Uh, at the same time, I wasn't playing with, you know, strategic geniuses, but you have to understand, I have baggage coming into this game. So just like Russell, you know, they could have turned around and voted me out right away, but at least I was able to, you know, say, look, it, I have the experience of playing three times. I can take this and I can help you in this game. In all actuality, I want to help myself. You know what I mean? But I was able to get my foot in the door. And by doing that, you know, I was able to start to create relationships and have them flourish that ultimately took me to the end. Do you think Natalie is the one tool that you needed the most? I think Natalie was integral. You know, she's she was essentially, you know, as Amber and I were in All Stars as far as, you know, a strategic alliance go. She had my back 100% no matter what. That's, you know, so difficult in this game. So let's talk a little bit about the Grant relationship. You kind of did a, a Lex move to him. No, I didn't do a Lex move to Grant. Grant took the game personal. And you know what? He said that there's a line that you're going to draw in the sand and you're not going to cross that. I, on the other hand, I don't have that line that I'm going to draw in the sand, especially not when I'm going on a show trying to win a million dollars. You know? I think you, you're handicapping yourself if you actually do that. So he took it very personal. It was tough for me to vote him out. I created a relationship with him and I'm sorry that he feels the way he does and that, you know, that relationship's not going to continue, but what can I do? All right, last question. Talk a little bit about having Amber and your daughters here tonight when you won the game. It meant the world to me. You know, Amber, Amber was in the dark. She obviously saw me come home at 150 pounds and knew that my sister had gone to the family visit, but I led Amber to believe that I was voted out at the final four. So it was a surprise for her. So when I finally came on stage, saw her in the audience, I could see the look in her face. And, you know, great, great family moment. Awesome. Well, congratulations again. Glad you finally got her out.